Well, I grew up with music in my family. I grew up playing guitar with my brother, and I grew up hearing my aunts and uncles sing music at parties, and that those were real nice moments for me. When I went to take classical guitar, it was very interesting, but it was a little too lonely for me. And so that's when I decided that it was more important to me on a personal level to to kind of get back to this kind of family-like environment to making music. That's good. Um... When I first started teaching kids in this neighborhood back in the 80s, most of the kids were primarily English-speaking Mexican-American kids or Chicano kids. And then in the 90s, the whole neighborhood changed because of the immigration, mostly Mexican kids speaking Spanish primarily. And there were all these the social issues bubbling up. There were a lot of gangs and a lot of violence. And the center was a place where we kind of got past all of that because it was a place where they were here to do something bigger than themselves and to do something bigger than their own interest. And that's why one of the reasons I think culture and art is so important is because it takes a person ab uh, outside of their, their, cons their daily concerns and their daily way of looking at themselves, and it gives them an opportunity to work towards something bigger. I think the fact that we're in this strip mall is significant. Here we are in this ex-liquor store, but the importance of a cultural center is not how grand it is, but how it's used. And we've tried to just take a very humble place and turn it into something beautiful from the inside out. And I feel that is what we're trying to do with kids too, trying to see that they learn to cultivate those things inside of themselves that are strong. Mm -hmm. 